What is going on, everybody? You're McLaren Speed Shop World Champion coming at you. We're back on Ray here, which is a deck I've been having a ton of fun with. It's, uh, I don't know, I just like the mechanics and stuff a lot around anything down related, as you uh, all know. And we'll try to get into some things here. And then, uh, sorry if my voice sounds terrible. I've been sick, <laughs> but I'm trying to be a little bit consistent with everything. So, just putting up uh, something easy. And yeah, the interesting thing standing out is Usopp. <laughs> so uh, I'm trying out some Rush Usopp here. The reason I have Rush Usopp is to keep up the, the overall just like breakneck pace of this deck, but to be able to keep up that pace and play the Judge more consistently. So normally what, to get to, like if you draw a Judge, I feel like you get into that weird middle turn where you don't know whether to play like kind of patient for a turn to get to the eight or push with uh, your characters. So to kind of alleviate that, test out Usopp. So you can then still have a rush to play and then still get to judge the next turn, depending on your situation. And then the only other interesting one that I've got in here, test out some Brick Fist, which I feel like is good for like end game or I mean early game too, early game option if you need to return something in someone's hand. But it just kind of depends on uh, sort of who you're playing and stuff like that. Obviously the hitting this in life trigger is nuts, but end game, being able to turn blockers against most of the top decks. I don't think anyone really runs one outside of the uh, four too much, so. But, I mean, I feel like you could easily drop this card if you want to add more uh, 2k counters. You could do that as well for some more defense. But, yeah, I'm just trying to try this out. And then we have Queen to help out with the draw, so focus a lot about some draw action and a little bit of defense there. Queen for, like, the Yamato matchups and stuff like that as well. But yeah, only interesting, super thing, big change is we're just testing out some, some Usopp. Is I feel like Usopp is, I don't know, I feel like it could be pretty pretty good playing against any of the removal decks. Because again, with uh, dropping this and just rushing at them, you're like they're going to remove stuff anyways, your four cost. So at least you get an extra swing to make them potentially lose a card or take life depending on the stage of the game, you know? And being able to just get up to judge while keeping up uh, attacks, I think is cool for uh, sort of like any kind of end game finishers. So, yeah, jump into some games and see how the Usopp strat works out. All right, we got some Sakazuki action here. Um, guess we'll keep this. Throw our search down and see if we can find our stage. All right, we do not grab our stage. Hmm. I am going to grab this just for the off chance because if they cost remove this obviously if they bottom deck it then the ggs if they don't though if they cost remove like ko then i could use sora to uh get this back and make that play so that's kind of my my thoughts right now okay glad we get this that's pretty big so i can trash this grab the our blue man there and then we'll attack them for seven Seven on five here. Soon get them down one. All right. We'll see. Sakazuki is super annoying to play against. It's because they have this Tachigi search now. I don't know why they were like, yeah, let's give them a one cost search and a two cost search. That's uh, pretty annoying on there. Um, we can take this. Okay, we get Usopp, which is actually kind of clutch. Because uh, Usopp will allow us to do some do some things. So I can block that. Saw that coming. So how do I go about this then? All right. I'm trash the search. Grab this. Um, a multitude of things we can do here. Cause I'm feel like I'm to call the bluff unless they get a something else. But I could play queen. And then attack for five, or attack them twice. Hmm. Yeah, let's attack them five and five and see what they do. So they block out of that with the Porcelino. Um. If I do Usa, push the pace there. Hmm. Save this Ogar Queen and draw out some of their like cost reduction for to keep him up. Yeah, let's do that. Why not? Turn one. Select one card to trash. I'll trash this. Okay, we get one back. Alright. 
So we get the Brick Fist, which is kind of decent. So if they play a block or anything next turn, I can return to sender that, which would be cool. But we'll see if we can... Alright, so they play Rebecca and Hina. Dang, I'm out of the two. They're going to play uh, Stinky Hound Blaze. Yeah, I saw that coming. Um, five on five. We'll block that. And then I'll block this one as well. Alright, well. There goes both of those, but I mean. Draw out the Rebecca at least. They use their ability, draw one trash one. So we're sitting here. So down our search. I need this. So that'll help. So I have two. The problem with this though, I don't want to return like any of these to their hand. <laughs> at least not at this stage. So I could play this. We get two. Hmm. And so I attack this. Can I go from there? So I'll return one there. I do that. Activate this first so we get our cards back there. Um, luckily, okay, so we're kind of vibing with all, all this. I'll grab Judge. So where am I at? I'm at five. So I need two turns either way here. Okay. Um, let's attack this five and five. Give them a sack something in hand. We're just going to survive a turn here. Because I can play Usopp, which is fine. So let's go into our, our blue ranger. Do this. Do that. Let's KO that. Alright. And then I have a 2k. We have two 2k's to block stuff if we need to. They're going to have to use some cost removal stuff here. I have Usopp to play for next turn to rush into whoever. And then we can play Judge the turn after that. Alright, well, if they're just attacking... If they're just attacking five, then who should I... Is, well, what do I have in here? Alright, well, yeah, I'll do that because uh, I'm going to bring it back with Judge in the following turn. Alright, I mean, that's a bit annoying with uh, that there. But, I mean, it is what it is. So I use Kai to block this. So, we will do that there. Alright. So, we get this. Okay. Do that. Grab. There's another one of these. So, I mean, it doesn't super matter. But, let's uh, attack the Hina a bunch here. So, if we get Hina off the board, then that's kind of decent for us there. We will attack it again. So they block it. Alright. Um how do I go about this then? Do this. Put the two on and then attack it. So seven on five. Dang, okay. That's kinda crazy. <laughs> I did not expect them to uh sack the Rebecca blocker and then keep uh Alright, interesting. If they, have, if they have the two 2Ks, they could have just played a 2K, and then... I don't know. That's, uh... It is what it is. They got a uh, Hound Blaze. Alright. I mean, that's fine. And they're playing Great Eruption. Alright, well, that's uh, not as fine. But we're still okay here. Obviously, can't really block anything. So, 9 on 5. Yeah, we gotta take this hit. And then maybe able to block this. So, 9 on 5. Alright, so yeah, then I can definitely block this. So, we're chilling there. We got them down to two cards here. So, this is where I feel like one avenue. So, I'm gonna play Judge. But let's do this first, see what we can grab. Alright, then maybe come in handy later. Because I can drop this down to 6, and then I can attack both. So, let me attack this first, 5 on 5. Let's see what they do. Okay, oh, well, that's actually massive. Alright, use card action, return 1, 2 cards to trash. We'll trash this, and... 
kind of want to keep this for the 2k and then this to remove if they play a blocker. Um, or do I just keep this? Hmm. Yeah, let's just do that. So I do this, this, and that. All right. Let's do this first to see what uh stuff we get. Okay, cool. We pull another one, so never mind. We're chilling. Um. Let me do this there. We'll pop uh, this guy, and then we'll do this here onto him. And then we'll attack him seven on six. All right, actually, that's killer. Okay. So we'll see what they can do. Obviously, we're keeping the brick piss in the the pocket. If they play Moria. Um. I'm trying to think, they'd have to play, or they play Hina. I don't think they have a way to KO any of our stuff, though. They don't have any, they don't have Robert in the trash. So it might be okay, then. They'd play, if they play uh, any blockers, I can return to the, the blockers to their hand, and then we're big chilling. Alright, let's see if we can pull this out. But, yeah, the breakfast may come in clutch here, as well. We got a 2k. Don't really need any of these. Keep him alive. So, it'll be close. But, I mean, it's still we've got a couple turns. Because, again, they're at three life. But we've got their hand low. Which is what I'm pretty happy about. Because we at least limit their options. Because, again, they don't have uh, Robert in the, in the trash there. So, they got the Great Eruption. I mean, it is what it is. So they're dropping that down. Okay, they trash the, the Moria. Okay, to play one. Alright. Well, the good news with this is uh, they don't have uh, anyone to KO. Like, straight up, we're kind of chilling. At least uh, that I can see. Unless they're trying to play Rebecca. But I think they goofed it by playing this guy active and not uh, not rested. So we'll see. Yeah. Okay. They realized they didn't have anything in. Oh dang! Their next card was Rob. <laughs> That's unfortunate for them. But uh, yeah, they realized they didn't have anything to KO on cost. Um. With that though. Oh man, I glitched. Just was able to see what was in their life, and now it's gone. I think we would have got they had a 2k so i would have been attacking with five characters minimum potential like uh at the six again i think we would have had them right there because the uh, two i just saw two of them were events so they were and one was the tashigi so 2k so i think we were golden to uh pull this one out Alrighty, we got a uh, some more yamato action here let's yoink our man here sent two both, well, one of each to the bottom of the deck, but since we have this, this is our play next turn. I mean, unless we get the, uh, dang. Okay. You're crazy. Alright. That's a wild and wacky play there, I'm not gonna lie. Um. So this leaves me with one. Potentially, let me just attack them five then. I mean, if they do double search next turn, that's not the worst thing that could happen. So, we'll see what we can pull from uh, from this. Alright, so I grabbed that. So, I need to save the 2k. And then we have this for next turn. Okay, cool. Actually, this is good enough. Because if they use both of these, they can only attack for 7, so I can block that. And we're, we're chilling. So they grab the eight cost kid. I mean, that's all right. And then we'll see if they grab a, a blocker killer. All right, do they got another one? Okay, that's actually insane. And then uh, they pulled another Bonnie. Bro, they got all their searches. That's actually, that's actually nuts. All right, well, we got to pop like all of these then. And so five on one, all right. Five on one. Um, what's the better play? I guess we'll do 
this. Do that. Pop that. Um, <laughs> I kind of want to make make a risky play here. Okay. Well, our next moves are choreographed. <laughs> We're gonna rush them into oblivion. Hopefully, before they can get uh, anything crazy here. So they got their other Bonnie. We know they have Kid. So they're grabbing a 2K. Okay, dude, they've got all the searches, man. Dude, if I could get... Alright, if I, if I could get Pudding, it's over for them. <laughs> like, straight up. We, uh... Be able to blast them, blast them away. So we'll do that. Stay up at uh, this in case they have any other wacky trigger shenanigans. Um, we'll play this. I don't think I'm, we need a judge this game. I'm supposed to pull another judge, but I mean it is what it is. Unless I played where I'm at five, I'd have to play super slow. Hmm. No, I want to just rush him down as fast as possible. All right, but I can do. We'll drop this. Turn one into this. Do this. We'll drop. Uh, I guess this one down. So this is at negative one thousand. So I can attack uh, with Kaya on that. So we're chilling there. All right, nothing they can do about that, which is fine. Attack this search. So I don't want to pull in like any other shenanigans or anything like that. So we'll attack him six on five. So they take the hit there. Attack him five on five. Okay. I I mean I guess they're just stalling. Okay. <laughs> I mean crazy play. They have 13 cards in hand. Um no. Block that. So they're gonna drop kid. Oh, okay. Never mind, they're not dropping kid. I have no idea what they're doing with all these cards. They're I'm about to drain them from like all the cards in hand this next turn. Okay. Like all these are gonna be gone. Alright, I have this. Alright, what can we grab out of this? I don't know if that really works. Uh, I need another ray is the problem. Cause I could bring this in and drop guess any of these down. This is only rest four or less. Okay. So I just drop this down to zero. So why not do that? That to there. Um, do this, drop that down to zero. Man, that leaves me with, with that. Okay. So I'll attack them five on five. Then they can't use this ability because this is our only four cost. But I need to drop this search, use this, and try to grab uh, another four cost ray. Potentially. Okay. So they do that, which is fine. Um. Alright, well now we'll just uh, blast away, I guess. Is, uh, again, if I just get a uh, pudding, we're kind of chilling. So now they gotta sack two cards here or a blocker. There's a bunch of cards I could get. Okay, so they do that. Interesting. Wait, now they're blocking this? Why didn't they just do it the other? Okay. Alright, so let me deploy this. Trash that, grab. Okay, well, dang it, pudding was the next card. That would have just won us the, the dang game. Man. Oh, how it goes sometimes. But, I don't know, we have the two. If they drop a kid. I mean, they'd have to risk it. Risk it for the biscuit here. Um... 
We'll block that. All right, putting one of each on them. All right. Ooh, okay, so we pull that as well. So I can make a bunch of uh, plays here. I'll have... Hmm. <laughs> That's no problem, though. I need to... I would need to play this first. Trash a card. And then play this. KO of that. And then I can play the... Oh, how do I... How do I want to do this? So I drop this out of six. And then we can attack it a bunch. Alright. So we gotta do that. Select a character to replace. Do this. Use a card action. We're gonna trash this for... Unfortunately. So then we'll grab this. Um, so how do I go about this then? Drop it down to that. So if I drop this down, hmm, for three, I pop this, or for four, I drop this down to six, and then attack it a bunch. I think that's our best play here. To do that, send one of those back to that, do this, drop that down. All right, grab that. Hmm. <laughs> I do need this, but need this more for the next turn potentially. All right. So I'll attack seven on six. Is if I need to, I can make the same play again next turn with Sora. All right. So they block that. All right. Do another seven on six because again we burn through uh everything in hand here we're kind of okay with that as well so I'll do another seven on six because pretty much this is i don't know kind of okay i think because they're sacking this guy all right so now i'll tack six on six and then i'll just do a bunch more sixes here Attack him again, six on six. Because, I mean, if we get them down to, like, no cards in hand, it doesn't even matter what uh, happens. So. They do that. All right. I mean, fine with that. Because we got them down to low cards in hand here. I do have a 2K. I have five characters on the board. So, if they go, they can't. They're in a tough spot. They can't really go for either. So, kind of okay with that. We'll see what happens, though. Because if they... I mean, they can use this. Okay, they're dropping Hody. Okay. I mean, they still have to put one on... Kid, though. And if they do that, I'll just make the same play. If they don't play with any blockers up, it's, it's GG's next turn. Like, straight up. They have three. They'd have, yeah, they have to put one on here. So we'll see. Unless they're going to attack me. So eight on five. Oh, okay. Wait. Well, now they don't have anything. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know why they did that. If I played my I played life so they couldn't use their ability to put it on the kid. I don't know if they forgot. I think they might have forgot. But okay. Dang. They, they had crazy, crazy draws. They got four... Yeah, four Bonnie searches. And then we just saw their other kid here. They had that, that, that. Nuts. But, uh, yeah. So, uh, we'll take that, though. Again, me, I'll make the little the combos there with uh, all of our characters. Hit the, I mean, you're able to hit the, the Red Ranger cycle. You're, <laughs> you're going to beat, like, anybody. All right, we got some ML action here. Let's see if we can draw... Alright, well, that's the worst outcome, <laughs> so we'll take that, I guess. Well, we got half of all of the, the rangers here, so we're close. I may be able to play slow for uh, for queen. So, I guess we're just going to attack, uh, attack them for eight, because why not? Get them down one off the rip here, just in case they have, uh, well, they hit the wimpy Hoshi, but... A lot of NLs have been playing the Wano cards, like Kiku and stuff. And NL is very, very annoying to play. Because, uh... They have the Sky Island. They have got, like, yeah, the Gadatsu and Yamato. That you want to play around. 
Um, we'll do that and that. Interesting play out of them early, but it's okay. So it puts me there. Still not what I need. So I'll make the queen play. I think here is what we have to do. So attack him five on five. Cause we gotta get something going. So throw down queen. Use that. Do that. Okay, this is huge for next turn, so I can trash that. Okay, we get another one. So we got the raise, I just need the baby one. But I'm gonna be at six, so we can draw this KO Nami or whatever. And the cool thing about Queen is we're chilling here. Um, alright. What do they have for six that they're dropping? Alright, I'll just block this. There. So yeah, we can just do that. They play Kiku. All right. I mean, that's fine. Play this. We will trash that. Try to grab. Ooh, massive there. So what do I want to do here? I have two. I can pop this. We might be able to play everything, honestly. So let me attack this. Five on three. All right, cool. And then we'll do this. Going to minus here. Do that, send target to hand, send that back to their hand. We got the ray as well. Bang. Hit that. We get okay. Alright. <laughs> I see I see the, the vision here. If we got if we got Drudge, well we still need uh baby Red Ranger, so we'll see how it goes there. Um hit the Kaya. Again, I'm playing uh, the reason I'm playing like this, yeah, I'll give them one, why not? Is uh be super super annoying here all right I will we'll trash this first all right well that sucks miss uh, on all those it is what it is do that we'll grab another 2k here so it leaves me here it leaves me with one so I could play Ray it leaves me with three we attack them down a bunch here if uh, so yeah we'll do that Still at four, so we're still kind of chilling with uh, certain things. So, yeah, we'll do another six. All right, they're playing defense now. So now we'll do seven, which will definitely hit. All right, cool. And then because we have two more in here, drop this ray because we're still looking for the Red Ranger here to kind of get things going. Alright, and we get one actually massive, and we have two Usopp's, and we have another queen. Alright, so we'll see how this goes. We just kind of need Judge now. If I uh, if I got Judge, then we make a bunch of plays, so the Hiori there is fine. Because again, I can play pretty defensive. This is going to be interesting though. We're about to have like crazy blows with the... Uh... Alright, um... We grant them one. Why not? Um, no, we'll block uh, that there, and then get them to attack with something else here. All right, so that's fine. All right, so how do I go about this? So play this minus this down, get this out, and then wail on them. I think is the best play. So let's do that. Into that, bang. Okay, cool. We get another one, which is uh, pretty big. So I'm gonna get rid of one of the Usops. Okay, grab another one of these, which is cool. Um, how do I wanna go? They're at six, so let's tack them seven on six. Put them in a weird spot. Okay, I'm gonna tack them six on six. All right. Attack them six on six again. Just, uh, if I train them out everything in their hand, then that's great for us. All right, cool. So I'll use two. Um, how do I go about this? I could attack them for six. I could play this. Get a. Uh, what do I want to grab back though? Grab the blue ranger back. Well, I don't have another blue ranger in here, so I could grab. I guess I don't really need anyone else. Hmm. Save the 2k to block. Alright. Yeah, why not? Let's just tack them down. 
Okay, so we'll see what happens here. They could drop the Yamato and KO uh, anything, because this is this is a crazy game. I haven't experienced a, a game like this. <laughs> I had so much life, it's fun. So, attacking eight on six, we cannot let that happen. So we'll do this and, hmm, we'll do this and this. Because I have the ray to play to bring something else back. And then the least one's eight. Interesting. Well, depending on what they attack. So they're attacking this seven on five. Alright, that's fine. Because I have ray, so I can bring it back next turn. Katakuri. Okay, so they're throwing the whippy Hoshi down. Alright, okay, if we can grab Judge, that'd be pretty clutch. It's like all we kind of need for uh, a bunch of stuff here. So I'll grab this, I guess, because I can play uh, blow both of them. Bofa. So let's do that. Bang. Turn this into that. Grab that. Minus that down. We get a the brick fist here as well. But I don't really need this right now. Um. All right. We'll tack them once here. Okay. So that's cool. I have. I could drop. Hmm. I could drop Usopp or Ray, kind of either or. So they're gonna play this, which is uh, fine. Let me attack them five on five and let's see what they do. Cause if I can bait them out of a card here, cause again, they have to draw three and trash two from their hand. So we can, we're kind of fine with that. All right, so I'll attack them six on five. So they play that, they got a trash two. All right, the trash is a Tori and a reject. Okay, so at least with me with four. Hmm. All right, we gotta attack him seven. All right, so we do that. I kind of want to play the Usopp because I feel like that's a, a play they don't expect. So let's throw Usopp down, and then we'll attack him five on five. Because now we at least put him in a weird spot. Okay, we get him down to one. Okay, well that's big, is if they do drop Yamato, then uh, these guys are safe now. Alright, yeah, saw that coming. Okay, they hit Queen, which is okay. I was uh, not expecting Queen to last so long, but we'll take it. Eight on six. Um, hmm, well they could attack, I guess we'll sack that one and then we can protect the board. So, that's fine. I can bring him back. So, no. And then we'll do that. And keep uh, Usopp up. And, yeah, okay. Massive, we get another one of those. So, I just need to. Uh, if we can get one of our other Red Rangers, then we're chilling. Brick Fist isn't really needed right now, I don't think. But we'll see. Let's trash this. Try to grab. Oh, massive. Absolutely. Things you love to see. That right there. So, return that. Bang, bang, bang. So we get that drop down. I just need, maybe I'll make both of them here. So this is down to six. All right, making another little play. Again, if we get everything out of their hand. Okay, that's a clutch. So I'm fine with that. Then let's attack here, just in case they get uh, some shenanigans. Like a Nami or anything. All right. Um. No, I need both of these so I can play both of them. Alright, so we'll attack him again. Which is uh, fine. Let's see what uh, what they get there. Alright, I'll attack him again. So they trash the Kiku. Which we're fine with. Okay, well... Uh, okay, <laughs> I mean I was going to play the smart thing, but I feel like I just got to do this. 10 on 5. Drain them out from everything in their hand. That's the next turn we're chilling. Or I just win there. Okay. Cool. <laughs> well, that works. I was, they're bricked up in hand. So I'd love to see that. That was a crazy game, though. I have an experienced one with that against an NL where we're just like. It's just bat the board battle like the entire time. We stayed at 4 life the entire game, which is nuts. 
there's uh there's one of our judges i guess so we were taking a hit there but oh yeah that was cool that was fun made the little the cheeky usopp play to push the pace there and it ended up working out for us in our favor so things you love to see and yeah obviously i thought that's crazy that they're brick with that many cards in hand i uh, definitely was not expecting that but yeah things work out and yeah i had a it was a good one uh thank you guys for tuning in and i'll see you in the next one